What's going on, y'all? Welcome to Jay's Life Out Loud, a channel about nothing, but it's about something. So, I'm coming back at y'all today. Once again, thank all my subscribers, everybody that show love, that took the time to watch a video, to like a video, subscribe, whatever. But what I'm coming at y'all today is, well, let's talk about, we all hear everybody every year on the New Year's resolution and what you plan on doing. I'm down here checking out beats uh, to do some new music. But every year we come across this. Oh, 2021 or two, whatever the year may be. And you've been doing this forever. And honestly, the days, the months, the years are starting to blend together. I don't know if it's me getting older or how we get older and time just fly by like that or whatever the case may be. But I tell you this, don't wait to January 2020, mean 2021 to uh, putting your, your plan in place. Don't wait to uh, then do it now. What's stopping you now? Make a pledge to yourself today to do something different. If what you've been doing is not working and you keep getting the same results, I don't care if it's weight loss. I don't care if it's finances. I don't care if it's romance. I don't care what the case may be. It's time for a change. You cannot continue to do the same thing over and over again. And what I'm telling you now is get off your lazy ass. That's what. Get off your ass and get up and get out. If you go to work and you work for a certain amount of time, I work from six to six sometimes, and it seems like everything is coming down on you. You don't have time to do anything, but you really do. Because if you got uh, two hours or three hours to watch a movie, that's three hours you could have been moving. And I know you like, I'm tired. I got to do this, uh, uh, whatever, whatever, whatever. You need to do something different. You need to work on something different. I don't care if it's a project, something that is going to better you. At least take an hour a day out, 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 hour out of your time every day to do something that's going to better you and make your life better. I don't care if you go to the gym for 15 minutes. I don't care if you go to the gym for 10 minutes. Uh, I was watching uh, Baxter Buzz, Baxter's Buzz on YouTube, and he was talking about Anything that you do consecutive, consecutively more than 21 days becomes habit. Imagine that. Imagine you decided today that today is the day that I'm going to get my ass up and go to the gym and I'm going to work out. And you did it for five minutes. I don't care if you walked in the gym, jumped on a tread machine for three minutes and walked out. At least you did something. My body in motion stays in motion. If you set your mind that I'm going to do that every day, so be it. If, if it's finances, if you're going to say to yourself, okay, I'm, I'm going to start being disciplined in myself. I'm going to stop blowing money. I'm stop, I'm about to stop trying to keep up with the Joneses. I'm about to stop uh, going out to eat every five minutes to start cooking at home and to bring my lunch to work instead of going to McDonald's, Burger King, Wendy's, or order and off DoorDash blowing your money. I'm talking to myself. So what I'm telling you is today is the day. You can make up your mind what you're going to do tomorrow. You can pack your lunch for tomorrow. You can get up 30 minutes or 15 minutes early and pack your lunch for tomorrow. You can start saving every week. Pay yourself 10%. If your job got a 401k, invest in the 401k. Invest in your future. People say, oh, there's no promise uh, of tomorrow yeah but if you say you got bad luck or this always happened to you whatever your luck is you gonna live for a long time and if you keep living like tomorrow it ain't coming you gonna be still in the hole 15 20 years from now so it's time to get out of the hole i encourage everybody in the sound of my voice to get up and do something new Show love to yourself. If you're doing everything for everybody else, you're looking out for people, uh, people uh, uh, your, your co-worker need a ride to work, you do it. Your, your wife need this or your husband need that or this person needs that. It is a time to invest in you. If you haven't been traveling, and I know it's COVID, start making some plans. So when it's time to get out, you have the money saved. You have the plans. I don't care if you're planning for the end of 2021 to take your trip. At least it'll be planned. And you put some insurance on it just in case you need to cancel or set the trip back. So what I'm telling you today 
is get off your butt. You are worth it. Kings and queens, y'all need to invest in yourself. I don't care if it's you want to go, you know, take an hour to learn how to, uh, in a, a day to learn how to invest in the stock market. Taking an hour a day to learn about Bitcoin. Uh, taking an hour a day to learn about savings and finances and uh, on how to turn your situation around. If you are in debt right now, I want you to, you can do something as simple. They sell these at the dollar store. They sell these at the dollar store. A pad and a pen or a pencil. I don't care if you're writing with a crayon, but if you get you a pad and a pencil, write down your goals. Take this, write down your thoughts, write down your ideas, write down your goals, because you have to start somewhere. And if it stays up here, it's not going to go nowhere. First, it, it, it's up here. You write it in this and you follow a plan to make that happen. And you speak it into existence. Stop speaking negative on yourself. If, if anything, you should get up in the morning and say, I am a king of kings. I am a, I am a, 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 a black king. I am a black queen. I'm going to get up this morning. I'm going to have a good day. I'm going to have a blessed day. Say your prayers or whatever you might do and head out with a positive, a positive mindset. You have to be the biggest influence on you. You have to pour into yourself so you can pour into others. If your children see you walking with high self-esteem, if your children see you uplifting yourself, they're going to do the same. A lot of us are going through mental things. A lot of us are having, uh, you know, COVID is not, a, uh, is, has not been fair to anybody. It's taking loved ones out here left to right. But as long as you have breath in your lungs, as long as you get up in the morning and you walk it, and you, been, you, you can hear, you can see, and you in your right mind, why would you give up? That's a blessed day. If you can get up, get out the bed, and go to work, and you got a job, it's already a perfectly blessed day. You just got to claim it and speak on it. Stop speaking negative into your life about things that are not going to change. Oh, this ain't going to happen. I ain't going to never find a husband. I ain't going to never find a wife. I ain't going to never find no good man. I ain't going to never find no good woman. Shut your up. Why would you, you wouldn't want you would fight somebody for speaking negative on your on your life. So why would you speak negative on your life? Don't wait to 2021. To make a resolution about what you're going to do when today is the day. Stop now. Start watching what you eat. Take that favorite thing that you know you eat too much of or that favorite drink that you drink too much of. Cut something out. At least one thing today. Cut it out. Make it make it for 30 days that you do something that you know is healthy for you. I don't care if it's saving a dollar a day. That's all I'm saying. You have to invest in you. You are a blessing. You blessing somebody every damn time you walk out the house, I hope. Planting seeds. You give everybody else a good advice. Take this advice. Invest in yourself. You know I'm going to take this time right now. And I'm going to say a prayer for you. Lord God, whoever is watching this video, Lord God, I ask you to touch them from the top of their head to the bottom of their feet, Lord God. Give them a new mindset, Lord God. Push them through to victory, Lord God. Lord God, let this person understand how special they are to you, Lord God, and how special they are in this world. Lord God, I'm asking that this video be a blessing to somebody to know that it is not over. It's just the beginning. You are worthy. You are worthy to get up and get out and get what's yours and what's coming to you. You are the best. Much love to you. I love you. Want the best for y'all. Stay blessed and stay safe out there. One.